It was in March 1996 that Sri Lanka won the 50 over World Cup. Four months later, James and Gabriel White, an Australian couple, shifted base to Colombo and set up the Cricket Club Cafe. The idea was simple: to fuel the island nation's obsession with cricket, which had just reached the next level after the World Cup win, and of course, cash in. As much cricket memorabilia as possible was put up on the walls of the old world bungalow. Signs and plaques were put up in other places, and the whites were in business. Since then, more cricket artifacts have been acquired: bats, balls, caps, gloves, shoes. Some of them dating back to the 1940s. Some personal items were in James's possession already. More came along from players themselves as they stopped by at the cafe during tours of Sri Lanka. And today, the Cricket Club Cafe is as much of a haunt for cricket fans as it is for players, local and the ones visiting. In 1996, the idea was actually my husband's. Uh, he knew that Sri Lankans were crazy about cricket. So we really thought that we would do a hard rock cafe of cricket, if we could call it that. The um, the response when we first opened the cafe back in August '96 was really overwhelming. Sri Lanka had just won the World Cup in the in the March, so by August, once we had all the memorabilia in, and guests could actually come and wine and dine in an establishment that was fully dedicated to cricket. So the response was fantastic. We were really thrilled with the way it took off in Colombo. It's it's been a painstaking time, if I could say. We we collected for many years prior to moving out to Sri Lanka. Uh, we managed to get the rights of some of the photographs that we wanted to host photographs from every test playing nation. So when people enter the cricket club, they, there is a wall dedicated to each country. Um, still we're collecting, we find that when the players come to the Cricket Club Cafe, uh, a lot of them have wanted to donate their own items to the cafe. Uh, they've either got their team members to sign them, um, and they've signed them themselves. And it, it's, it's a huge thrill for us when cricketers actually say that they want to be on the walls of the Cricket Club Cafe.